I'm white trash and I'm in trouble. Relax and take notes while I take totes of the marijuana smoke. Oh, you want to choke? Gun smoke, gun smoke. Oh, no, it's not. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> that sounds just... I feel terrible. <laughs> For our dedicated fans, what I mean dedicated fans, I mean, what, how many people watched it? Like a hundred? <laughs> one, <laughs> one person, one lonely kid planning a school shooting happened to stumble on our video. Probably. He's just like, I want to be just like these guys. I want to be two pedophiles that go. <laughs> that make I'm a registered. <laughs> I'm a registered. I should, uh, when I do that, I need to be like, I'm a. I need to like almost like Yosemite Sam. I just start sex offender. <laughs> oh man, it's been months, dude. It's been like it's half been a months. year. We're back, fucking. Why white. you gotta say it like that? That's like when somebody's got a ten-year-old kid and they're like, "He's a decade." Like, shut up. <laughs> Yo, it's been six months. Six months is half a year, so they have to know it's half a year. You so don't have to say it like that. It's your f- I'm just kidding. It's not your fault at all. You've you've it got is. well, technically, <laughs> I don't want to be that asshole. You know, I mean, <laughs> you you're doing you're asshole. You just tried to display. <laughs> well, you're doing good things, man. I mean, like I'm doing okay things, I'm but not even been... embracing my autism. <laughs> I've embraced my autism since I guess when I guess I was diagnosed, and I guess maybe I was like four. Really, you know? Did I'll I ever, did I, did I ever tell you the time? When um so in school I had an IEP which is like a basically like a uh, male a, version of an IED. Yeah, no, but sure, no, <laughs> it's it's basically like on paper saying I'm retarded. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I, a paper. <laughs> I I guess I couldn't I could read back then sort of I barely can now. Um no so fucking like he's a Slavic Jew ninety percent retarded. <laughs> <laughs> I'm only half cheap. Um, <laughs> the the other half is me beating the shit out of my wife. I'm just kidding. I love her. Actually, she's in the shower. <laughs> What'd she say? She. I said half of me would be me beating the shit out of my wife, and then she said, "I'll be beating the shit out of you." <laughs> <laughs> she's, she's actually in the shower. She's Matthew. naked <laughs> right now. She's naked in the shower and afraid. And we're white trash want- and in trouble. All right, what do you think? Tit for tat? <laughs> Is it, when'd you get that? A drunken night with Noah's dad. <laughs> Just recently, or? Uh, babe, when did we uh, do tattoos? A couple weeks, month ago. Oh, no kidding. I, I, when, I, when you, I, no, that when your Ocala show, when we did Noah's college tour. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm, I, you know, you probably yeah, didn't show me, but remember, I'm autistic and stupid and Slavic and Jewish, so I didn't, I wouldn't know. <laughs> but so the person who is not to be named, even though I've named more than enough already, <laughs> we, we went and did the college tour. Yeah. And uh, you know how him and I get when we're, you know, hanging out. We ended up, uh, the girls got back to the hotel and they wanted to take a nap and him and I wanted to go have cigars and drink. And it ended up him and I next to a bar uh, in, in a bar that was right next to a tattoo parlor. And it started with a, we should get Snoopy tattooed on our asses. <laughs> and I was like, listen, I love Snoopy. He's my favorite <laughs> Peanuts character, but I'm not getting him tattooed on my ass. <laughs> like, I'm going through like downtown high five. And everybody. I was like, dude, I bet I can get this person high five me. And he's like, no. And like, then I got everybody in a line to like, high five me. And it turned right. into a high five kind of night and we got it done. All right, I'm going to say this now, and I'm going to do this. I want to get Iago the parrot tatted on my ass or wherever on my body. <laughs> so I could just show people be like, I just don't believe it. <laughs> anyway, IEP, uh, I never got to finish this because you'd love to interrupt me, EJ. Yeah, uh, you're <laughs> <laughs> no, so I, I never liked using my IEP because I was, you know, I just was insecure about it. Basically it, it helped me like get more time on taking tests and shit. We shut the stop smiling. <laughs> you know, <laughs> like you, you're, you're supposed to embrace us tards, not make fun of us. But <laughs> you're like, Scotty, you're supposed to draw with the crayon, not eat it. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, in college, 
uh, I was like about to get my my AA, and I remember I had like one more test to take, and my mom was like, "You got to, you should, you should tell me you have an IEP to get it longer." I'm like, I don't fucking need it. I don't fucking need it. I don't fucking need it. And so I was, I guess maybe I was a little overwhelmed. I was like, maybe I could uh, say I have it. And then literally, they're fucking the like the, the guidance counselor and the people at the college literally went from like, we got a, a great student ahead who's going to be getting his uh, AA, hopefully his bachelor soon, to literally like. A special needs volunteer. They're like, oh, what are you <laughs> studying? And I'm like, for fuck's sake. <laughs> you have a bachelor who's in AA and he's retarded. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, EJ, it's it's always good fucking doing work with you, man. It really is. I miss you. You were coloring in elementary school and they're like, here, use the crayons and color. Scotty, separate those colors. You, you kind of color outside lines. Or Daddy said that the colors can't be in the same line as us. <laughs> Why do you think I'm so good at fingering? Because I all I did was finger paint, you know, from elementary, middle, and high school. You know, I had a fucking finger paint to make macaroni art. <laughs> Looks like you ate all your macaroni art. <laughs> <laughs> hey, macaroni and cheese art. <laughs> I fucking miss well, you. You, well, you look like you made a Fruit Loops necklace, gave it to a girl you liked, and then she said, "Fuck you, EJ." <laughs> no, I took a pearl necklace from a Fruit Loop. <laughs> ah, <laughs> and the Fruit Loop put a, and, and and that Fruit Loop put a fucking put some Ritalin in your tequila right there. It's water. That's not water. You oh, will yeah, never. It's right. right. Casa Blanco. <laughs> anyway man no it's it's great it's great being here with you it really is i've missed doing uh this podcast can't Same. Do, can't do with anyone else man but you because you the shit i tell you i tell you that every day every time i see you and i only see like once a month now and i fucking hate oh, that. you said you smell like shit <laughs> <laughs> Is it because I'm wearing a track suit? Is, it, is that why I smell like shit? <laughs> no, you say it to me. <laughs> that was oh, the I, smell like shit doesn't mean there's a shit. <laughs> well, I mean, I know you. I mean, you're you're fucking you're transporting Jews <laughs> from one. I'm getting in touch with my German ancestry. <laughs> <laughs> All right, all right, we're all right, we're 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 I getting. Estimation, you say. <laughs> On the board. Toot, toot. I mean, I know how excited you were from the Zinazi rally for the first time in eighty-five years at Madison Square Garden. <laughs> Even though they had fucking Israel flags waving around the background too, I'm like, oh, it's so, so anti-Semitic right there. Jews <laughs> hating their own kind. What is this fucking? <laughs> What is it, the Jerky Boys? <laughs> Dude, did you see like somebody called uh, Benjamin that not Yahoo a Nazi, and it's like, bro. <laughs> I, I know, I know a lot of people. Opposite. I know a lot of people that I that I love dearly that think Net, Net and Yahoo is a uh, a Nazi, and I said, well, you're a fucking Yahoo if you think. <laughs> hey, Yahoo, you're a Scotty G. <laughs> Instead of the SS officers, the EJ officers. <laughs> EJ. You're like, Netanyahu's a Nazi? Mm-hmm. Did you have an IUP? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. All right. We're getting a little we're we're getting a little off topic here. It's like it's like okay. it's like it's like we never left. It's like we never left, you know. <laughs> Because so most of the time, to... most of the time when people people do podcasts and that or whatever kind of like collaboration they do, uh, it's all it's all like, oh, it's really good to see you again. We're just like, fuck you. Let's get right <laughs> back into this shit, man. <laughs> you chip tooth bastard. I've been trying to get you on here for six months. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you've been having fucking gang bangs on the railroads, the underground <laughs> railroad. <laughs> Dude, Rick's bit about the Underground Railroad. We don't want to spoil it. it. It's a good bit. I'm not gonna say it because it's his shit. (laughs) Yeah, oh my god, it's great. It's it's fucking. 
<laughs> anyway, all right. Well, welcome to White Trash and in Trouble. Um, I'm EJ Salter. And I am EJ Salter. Retarded. <laughs> Retarded. I, and I have an IEP. <laughs> <laughs> I'll have to show you, man. It's like I literally got shit now, like a 200 document page of like how stupid I am back in like 1998. <laughs> it's like Scotty doesn't know what blue is. When he looks at the sky, he's just like, what is that? You know, <laughs> why is oh, the sky yeah, wet? Right. <laughs> he won't wear his helmet properly. <laughs> he keeps Scotty fucking had sex with a gay guy. And the gay guy said, I want to come in your mouth. Scotty said, Nobody comes in my mouth. So the guy came on the window and let nature take its course. <laughs> There's Scotty. <laughs> so I was doing that when I was six. I was sucking off gay guys. <laughs> you know, when you got to pinch a penny. <laughs> yeah, I mean, okay, spe- so- especially, when, especially when your teacher's like Ben Stein, Bueller, Bueller, <laughs> pinch a penny. All right, white trash and in trouble. We fucking made it. So I love to explain this because I love to annoy you. Uh, for the ones who do not know what the show's about, uh, EJ and I, we find the most insane, ridiculous articles on the Internet and we uh, make fun of them. You know, it could be anybody getting arrested or typically someone white trash. You don't they don't have to necessarily be white. You know, they could be fucking can, what, what can they be, EJ? They can be white. They can be yellow. They can be brown. They can be black. They can be poor. They can be rich. They can be happy. They can be a bitch. Doesn't matter. That's Everybody like a good there. fucking Dr. Seuss <laughs> riddle right there. <laughs> One fish, two fish, Muslim fish, Jew fish. <laughs> One blows up, the other sues you. <laughs> Dude, wait, real quick on that. You know I had a neighbor who was Palestinian before, right? Oh, yeah? Like, yeah, and she had a, a quick temper, and she hated, like, some of my jokes. You know? Of course she <laughs> fucking did. Yeah. <laughs> So uh, one day I said something and her husband was like, dude, don't you that? She's going to get mad. And I was like, oh, yeah. Ooh. Let me ask you one question before you get mad. And she goes, what? And I was like, are, your anger. What type of anger do you have? And she goes, what do you mean? I was like, well, are you implosive or explosive? <laughs> <laughs> explosive. <laughs> so I'm white trash and I'm in trouble. <laughs> and we love you for that. Uh, do you want to go first with this shit? Why not? Who yeah, went let's... first last time? Can you remember six months ago? Oh, he sure. Yeah, I can remember six months. I can't even remember the last time I fucking wiped my ass. Technically, it was today. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say, dude, I, I hope that's like a memory. Miranda, kick him. <laughs> my poor chair. Miranda's got to clean it later. Oh, my God. This explains so much. Like, Miranda's so beautiful, and she's, like, taking your caretaker because you have an IUP, and she's a caregiver. IUP. <laughs> I, sh- I shouldn't have told you this. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm part I'm of the LGBTQIEP. AID. <laughs> DEI. <laughs> LGBTQIED. IEP. Community. International. <laughs> Edging penises. All right. Go on direction. Go on with the fucking thing. Did you say Damn one it. direction? Dude, I nope. don't want to go off the balcony. Well, we don't have to talk about my bit, but <laughs> we'll talk about <laughs> it later. All right. Get on with the fucking article, Salter. <laughs> so on this week's episode of White Trash and in Trouble, once again, we prove you don't have to be white. But mm-hmm. I do show that you can be white trash and teach other white trash a lesson. Uh huh. So coming to you out of, you're gonna love this name, Beaverton, Oregon. <laughs> There's probably a lot of beavers in Beaverton, especially Oregon. Those fucking hippie bitches up there. There's a goop behind you. <laughs> <laughs> Your caretaker's in her robes. <laughs> Me, uh, go make your bed, Mr. Itchy Talk. All right, so just read <laughs> in Beaverton, Oregon. Yeah, a black male decided he was going to steal an SUV from a supermarket parking lot. Yeah, right, Grand Theft Auto. Yeah, so white trash. 
as he takes off in the in this SUV, he notices there's a four-year-old strapped in the back seat. Furiously, he makes a U-turn and found the child's mom, whereupon he berated her for her negligence, ordered her to get her child out of the car, threatened to call the cops. Once she took the kid out, he stole the car again. <laughs> <laughs> like he's, that kind of reminds me. It? Do you remember the movie uh, Bush Bushwhacked with Daniel Stern? He played Marv from Home Alone. Yeah, 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 yeah. Where he's on the camping trip with the kids. Yes, yeah. So he, he's, he, he's hiding out from the police. So there's a scene in the movie where he goes to steal a car. And as he's like stealing this woman's fucking like minivan, he goes in and he's he's about to drive off. And this, this little fucking like four year old in, in the back seat in like a fucking uh, in like a ki- kitty booster seat. He's like, Mister, I got to take a dookie. <laughs> and then he just leaves him on the side of the road. But luckily, we had fucking. Um, uh, God damn it, I don't want to fucking say anything terrible. But uh, he came back, did due diligence, do good due diligence, whatever the fuck how you say it. He's like, hey, hey, good if, if you're going to leave your car, if you're going to leave your, if you're going to, if you're going to fucking leave your car, make sure your kid's out, okay? <laughs> and then he just steals it again. I fucking love that. <laughs> I picture it being way more like, I don't know, leprechaun in the hood. <laughs> so... Did he get arrested? Uh, I'm pretty sure he did. Listen, all I needed was that headline of man stole car, to, uh, found child, return, and stole car again. Okay. And then when I found out, like, uh, <laughs> he said what she did was not a crime, but it should have been. <laughs> <laughs> I like how I like how he had to go out and say what, no, she, what he has not yet been caught, but they do have video of it. Do they have video of him lecturing her? No, no. Uh, like, I would love to see security cam footage of him fucking literally like raising his hands like this, where you can't you can't hear what he's saying. But he comes back, he gives a kid, he, and he's just like, "You ought to be a fucking ashamed of yourself. How dare you leave this fucking kid in the car? While I'm gonna go ahead and steal the car. You're lucky I came back for. You're lucky I came back for. You're lucky I came Here's back for and gave him back to you. Okay." All right. Now you got to bow to me, man. This is Oregon. You, this is BLMster. You got to bow to me. You got to give me the reparations. So this, <laughs> so this, what if the, what if maybe the cars is reparations, you know? <laughs> wait, oh, wait, 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 wait. Just watch. Watch this. Oh, one. you have it. This is also the news. I can't hear I it. Channel it is. It's visible on there. There is no sound at the moment. Oh, I'm wow. Yeah. He, he, Oh wow, he actually fucking ah. <laughs> Oh my god. So oh wait a minute. So he okay. I thought you said he went and like lectured the little woman. He he literally just dropped he just threw the baby in a, in like a building and That's then just the drove clip I, I saw, but according to the news article, he did find her and give her a lecture. Like he opened the door and put the baby inside. I was like, hey bitch, come get your kid. <laughs> Do they sound like that in Orchid? <laughs> He's like, that guy stole my car. He gets out. Yeah, bitch, I stole your car, but let's talk about the real problem here. You left your motherfucking kid in the goddamn backseat. What type of irresponsible bitch does that? Bitch, I was fucking abandoned in the backseat. <laughs> I was motherfucking abandoned. <laughs> oh, man. The baby starts talking like Gilbert Godfrey. <laughs> That's your kid. Bulls, that's black. <laughs> All I know, I was sipping on my bottle and then walked a black guy who took my mother's cup. Someday, I want to hear a black guy say, today, I got in the elevator. There was a Jew in there. I got so scared. He was threatening me. He was staring at me and felt so embarrassed. There was a Jew in the elevator threatening me. <laughs> Nobody believes your story, sir. <laughs> <laughs> like the le- least threatening group of people, unless it's the IDF. <laughs> Ruin and find out, motherfucker. <laughs> Do you think, like, when the IDF was like shooting Hamas people, they're like, oh, my, my shoulder. <laughs> 
I thought we were going to get the recoil like a little down, okay? Because last time, remember when we got the KSM, okay? We was firing them and it hurt my collarbone, okay? And you said that you were going to get the gun that was more accurate with less power and less kick because I had to get a shoulder surgery. <laughs> my tore my cockix. It really hurts. <laughs> when you told yeah, me I was gonna it's because the ammo is cheaper, Mo. You t- <laughs> <laughs> hey, well, what's the big idea that porcupine? <laughs> oh my god. Imagine doing a three oh, stooges oh. bit as the, them as the IDF. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit. Oh my god. <laughs> Didn't they already have one where it was yeah, well they have them. Um, well, they, they they have like Mo uh, pretending to be like Hitler, but they don't. But oh my god, like imagine them being like IDF soldiers, and like and they're going after like fucking you know Hamas people and shit. They're just like saying, "Oh God, it's the pig people, <laughs> the pig people, Hamas." <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> you get them all. <laughs> they're gonna get us banned like Ayatollah Khomeini. <laughs> hey man, you know. <laughs> Season two of White Trash and in Trouble, baby. What the fuck you gonna do about it, YouTube? You're not gonna do shit. I got a fucking letter saying, "Good job, Scotty." You ain't gonna do shit either. I got a fucking placard saying, "Scotty, you're doing a hell of a job." Hold on, I gotta put this back. Weirdest flex ever, right now. It is the. I I don't even like it. I don't know why I have it. To be honest with you. <laughs> Scotty's like, I got this plaque on the wall. I'm like, I got this plaque on my teeth. <laughs> uh, I, got, I got plaque on my teeth too. It's okay. I got to get a cleaning. Actually, I think I think I get one on the two days before the next Roma show. I know a kid in jail that had plaque on it. What? <laughs> what? I said I know a kid in jail who had black on his teeth. <laughs> <laughs> you mean white? <laughs> At the end of it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all right. Oh, I did no. question to that article, right? One, first of all. Yeah. How dare that mother? Unfucking believable. You know what's worse than her leaving her kid in a car? What? Raising it in Oregon. <laughs> You got a point there. Ah. Nothing good comes from Oregon. Yeah, unless you like fucking the Goonies <laughs> and pirates, and I don't know. Um, butt pirates. Yeah. Butt pirates, yeah. All right. <laughs> well, EJ, I will fucking say that the man who got arrested is white trash and in trouble. Very good article. But who's more white trash and in trouble? The guy that stole the car or the woman that left her kid in the car for it to get stolen? I think the kid is more white trash. Yeah, right? How he didn't he didn't do anything. He just he just <laughs> sat there. He's just like, bitch, take me. You know? I wanna <laughs> I wanna be I wanna be raised by you guys. I want I want you to go get milk. What if like the dude was like, Oh my god, there's a baby in there. Let me let me get him out of here. And then he was like, as he was taking it to like an orphanage or something, he was like, you know what? No, you probably got a parent, and that bitch needs to learn something. You probably got a parent. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Are you ready for mine? Yeah, what you got for me, Mr. Cheap? So I mean, this cheap. so this one was back in May of this year. Drugged up Kentucky driver hands over bag of meth and fentanyl pills and $3,000 when cops asked for his identification. <laughs> he said, bitch, you don't know who I am? I'm the best dealer in Kentucky. <laughs> bitch, you don't know who I am? I'm rich! <laughs> and, but literally, the, the beginning I'm of the article... Kyle. The beginning of the... Wait, what? He said, bitch, I'm Cartel Kyle. Oh, my God. <laughs> Carl Tell. <laughs> Uh, oh my god that's funny Carl don't ask don't tell alright <laughs> so the literally the beginning of the article says what a meth <laughs> a Kentucky man pulled a, pulled a bag of drugs and a wad of cash when police officers asked for his ID sir can I please see your identification 
It's literally kind of just going like, you know, but worse. <laughs> so the name's great. Um, David Ratliff. Hopefully no relation to Rick. Uh, age 43. <laughs> he homeboy looks way older than 43. He looks like me that if I like it. really let myself go. No, that's called meth. Hey, I'm trying to make his face. <laughs> Put your glasses on. I, I hang on. Do I have fake glasses here? Hold on. Hold on. Still... Fuck fake ones. You got real ones that look like. Yeah, that. they're in my car, motherfucker. Hold on. <laughs> you look like bubbles. If he ate bubbles, I look like Milton from Office Space. What <laughs> happened to my stapler? <laughs> oh, we're gonna we're gonna clip that one right there. All right. Oh. So, uh, David Ratliff, age forty three, was passed out behind the wheel of his car on Friday in the parking lot. Fuck you. I have to fuck it. We got 10 more minutes left on this thing, but it's okay. Um, on U.S. Route 421 in Manchester, about 100 miles south of Lexington. Uh, when the police arrived at the scene and asked the drug that Ratliff for his ID, he whipped out a baggie of meth pills and a large sum of U.S. currency. Uh, police confirmed that he had nine grams of meth, several pills, and three, $3,034 in cash. He was arrested in tra on charges of trafficking in a controlled substance and public intoxication. He was taken to the Clay County Detention Center. And that was it right there. I, that's a great one right there. I mean, like, like how fucked up do you have to be to, like, not I'm give your fucking ID? <laughs> like, yes, you're... <laughs> do you think ID, like, he thought was, like, like stood for, like, indoor drugs or something like that so he's just like oh here i got them right here <laughs> what if his name was matt fenton <clears throat> <laughs> and he was like well do you like playing charades <laughs> <laughs> no what if he what if he thought he was playing uno and he was gonna use the a uno switcheroo card on the cop and he was gonna give him the meth and the drugs and then he was gonna and the cops gonna give him his badge and gun then he was gonna <laughs> arrest him Reverse, <laughs> reverse, reverse, and then, and then, and then, fucking, uh, I almost said Eric Ratliff, and then fucking Dave Ratliff was like, "It's time for me to arrest your motherfucking ass now." Man. <laughs> <laughs> He's like the Down syndrome cop. Do you know why I pulled you over? Because I have drugs. No, because you're black. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think the Down syndrome guy knew exactly what was going on when he told him that? <laughs> I hope not. <laughs> He's like that funny. <laughs> oh man, this this podcast. Well, how do you is... know that that guy was white? What the? Oh, the guy who got arrested. Yeah, oh, he was white. white. How I know because he went to the county jail and not morgue. <laughs> ah, <laughs> wow. EJ's back, True. baby. <laughs> I mean, hey man, I'm surprised. Like you know, I mean, touching fentanyl with your with with your skin, it'll go right through it and fucking kill you. Yeah, I, I got my ID, officer. Stop resisting, dude. <laughs> He's oh. got a rap for us. <laughs> well, that was a great article, David Ratliff from fucking Manchester, Kentucky. You are white trash and in trouble. Sorry, pal. His cousin not really. Daniel Ratliff plays Harry Potter. <laughs> Daniel Ratliff. <laughs> and a he, white supremacist. <laughs> I'm a white. <laughs> That's another. One. I should do that for. I should do that as I like can add on to like boy, the the girls got cookies and. <laughs> Oh, oh, nice. All right, you know what? I can't. We can't talk about that now. But uh, <laughs> anyway, e EJ, that was a fucking great time, man. It was, it's great fucking doing this podcast with you, and I'm and I'm and hopefully we can like try to do this like biweekly or you know bisexually, bisexually you know bisexual. maybe even full on gay as well too. <laughs> you know, I'm Finally, down. We'll have to get the Spanish translation called uh, Blanco Trash and in Trouble. <laughs> <laughs> Blanco trash and in trouble -o. <laughs> Or we can get Tony Hinchcliffe on here to say, oh, Puerto Ricans. <laughs> There's a bag of trash in the Atlantic right now. I, did you see um, 
I forgot who posted it, but it was like some lady who was like Puerto Rican. She said like the reason why the joke hit so hard in like her community was because Puerto Rico has a big landfill problem and stuff. And I'm like, well, I feel like every island in the Caribbean does, you know, <laughs> hate to say it. Their biggest landfill is the people that were still there when the Spanish landed. <laughs> That's so fucked up. That is fucked up. <laughs> Anyway, hey, well, hey, white trash and in trouble. Hold on. Speaking of white trash and in trouble, hold on. This hold is something on. that got sent to me today. Oh, yeah? Yes. Hold on. And this has got to be edited out. Oh, come on. No, 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 no. Oh, you fucking dick. Come on, man. <laughs> Well, once you, <laughs> come on, hey, 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 turn that off, turn that off, man. Come on, don't, I got, I got to do some editing here. <laughs> You're making me edit more. Set it short. <laughs> if you guys don't know, well, if you, if you guys didn't catch that, uh, hopefully you fucking didn't. It's a clip from Adam Driver from the movie Black Klansman when he said EJ's favorite fucking word. <laughs> don't Piece do it. <laughs> One word in the south. <laughs> hey, you piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're killing me, man. All right, brother. All right, brother. I know you gotta. You, you just sent it to me too. I like how he just sent it text to me on Facebook. <laughs> you fucking idiot. <laughs> I love you. I love you, man. Anyway, hey, well, I dude. Ate, man. I freaking I got uh got off the choo choo plane and I told Shannon I was like, man, I'm gonna pick up food on the way home. Like, oh yeah, what? And it ended up that we went out for dinner instead. Too. Yeah. Oh hell yeah! Uh, we can go ahead and end it. We can talk for a little bit after. But anyway, I am Scotty motherfucking Chi, and I am Scotty Chi, and I am EJ Blubs to suck on Dick Saltler. <laughs> Saltler. <laughs> I am Scotty High Cholesterol Chi. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, when I'm white trash. I'm fucking EJ Lloyd Christmas Salter. <laughs> well, everyone, the ending tag. <laughs> We're white trash. And we are in trouble. Have a good night, everybody. <laughs>